A principle reads that practicing meditation can increase learning and retention for students who have experienced trauma. She decides to test the truth of this by conducting an experiment at her school. A group of 60 10th grade students are all given the same academic schedule with identical math, science, English, and history classes. The only difference in their schedules is first period. 30 of the students are given a meditation class for first period. The remaining group has a free study hall period. At the end of the semester, the principal collects the scores from the academic classes of all the students, then compares their grades. She finds that the group who meditated did 5.3% better on homework and 10.1% better on quizzes, but did not score significantly higher on exams. The meditators scored 2.1% lower on projects. So another thing we said, your experiment will have an experimental group and a control group. Guys, what did we say the experimental group was? Because number six asks us to identify the experimental group. That's the group that gets the independent variable. In this case, the one getting the independent variable are the students in the meditation class. I actually took this study from real research that's been done is that students who've experienced any kind of trauma have a, usually it'll present like a learning disability. If you've been through significant trauma, it'll look like you have learning disabilities when you don't. And meditation is a real way to stop it. But the, the first time I heard of this, they were trying to get me to get my students to meditate. And I cannot even imagine trying to get a group of GED students to meditate with me, y'all. So I've never, never done this in a classroom. Okay. <laughs> when you do yoga. I mean, exactly. Can you imagine if I tried to get you all in downward dog? I just don't even want to think about what Eric would say. Okay. <laughs> just Lord Almighty. The students in the meditation class. Then I want to identify the control group. So what was the control group? This is that comparison group, the group that doesn't get the independent variable. So in this case, if meditations are independent variable, the group who didn't get it was the group in study hall.